Hey gang, this is Steve with Guitar Center. We're at NAMM 2020, hanging out in the Akai booth with Andy, and we're going to check out the latest in the MPC line, the MPC-1. How you doing, Andy? I'm doing really well. How are you? I'm good. Uh, this looks really exciting for the uh, sort of budding producer getting into the MPC game. Yeah, you know, th this is a really exciting time for us because, like, the whole beat making industry is so vibrant right now. You know, hip hop is just such a big culture. And to bring the MPC platform and the standalone technology down to a price point that allows, you know, people to come onto it now is, is fantastic for us. It really is. You know, these you know, features that are on the MPC are so iconic, but then now, you know, we've used all of our technology to give you, you know, plug-in effects, instruments, sounds, all of the beat making features, layering drums, all the stuff that the kids need to make really fat beats. Yeah. And so in terms of being able to sort of work with it on its own and then build it out to uh, sort of be a, like a central hub for your gear, how does that work? So you've got two choices, right? So the standalone aspect makes you really kind of like create dynamically with the music because you're, you're not tied to the door. So you're, you're focused on the sounds, the beat, the groove. And then if you want to use any of the DAWs there, Alice, if you want to put this into FL or Logic, you can just stem it out or you can put it into controller mode and use it as a plug-in. So you've got the best of both worlds. But the fact is, it, it's supportable, it's compact. You know, everyone's trying to condense their studios down because of the size, fits in the studio nice. But one of the amazing things about it is all of the tactile buttons. You've got a button for every feature. And what that's done, that's also resonated to the class, you know, the classic um, XL guys as well. So awesome workflow, yeah. Really cool. So it seems uh, pretty intuitive, pretty uh, well laid out. Can you just show us a little bit about the workflow? Yeah, yeah. So really, really simple. So you could start kind of launching melodics and vocals and clips. So we've got a huge factory library in here. Now we've been working with people like Decap, um, Raw Cuts, MSX Audio, MVP. So you've got so much stuff that's like ready to go. But what you can also do, so once you say you've got a kit up here, They're all ready to go, but you can also go into like um, notes mode and start using instruments and start using chord progressions. So, now you'll know that'll work straight on a beat straight away. You can then bring in some like filter types. So for me, that's a really important aspect of like the creative process, makes it fun, hands-on, right? So once you've got that, right you can start doing stuff like this so there's the musical aspect you can go to the grid we can look at the notes okay then all your beats come in bass lines everything's running standalone you can do all your mutes bring your effects in we could go to xy effects tape stops So you've got all of the tricks and tips that people are using in today's productions. And, and you can see that way I'm just, I'm engrossed in the hardware. I'm not getting sidetracked. Once I got my track running, I could just go to export, go to export and that's it. I can have all the separate parts and then continue in my DAW. So yeah, it really resonates to the whole new generation of beat makers. Well, I mean, watching you use it, it's pretty much like playing an instrument. There's a knob per function happening here. So everything quantizing so you start your you know you start your production so let's just say we go to a new sequence go to a kit we could go to a um, kit here so you're feeling it once you've put your beat down hit quantize add swing you can move all the notes if you want like the kind of like that kind of more dealer vibe you can just go in and dial these things in so yeah amazing so uh really cool looks like a really interesting way to sort of jump into the game of making yeah. beats how soon are we going to be able to see this at our local gc they're going to be within weeks okay cool within weeks you'll see the mpc one from akai at your local gc keep checking guitarcenter.com for more new from nam